basic principle of organic electrosynthesis. In electrochemical organic reaction, substrate may undergo anodic oxidation with the removal of electron from the electrodes or the substrate may be subjected to cathodic reduction with the transfer of electron from the electrodes to the substrate in solution. Due to instability, radical intermediate can undergo radical reaction or even undergo oxidation or reduction and may react with other compound to promote electrophilic substitution reactions, nucleophilic substitution reaction and formation of acidic or basic species. They can also promote addition, elimination and cyclization. Direct and indirect synthesis. Electrosynthesis can be classified basically into direct or indirect synthesis depending on the type of electron transfer. In the direct reactions, electron transfer occur directly between the surface of the electrode and the organic substrate. In this context, all the essential properties of the electrochemistry are completely applied without any mediator. On the other hand, indirect reactions are those reactions where the exchange of electron occur between a mediator and the organic substrate. Major advantage of indirect reactions are that the redox mediator change the applied potential required for the electron transfer, making the potential range milder and less side reactions can occur, avoiding over oxidation, dimerization, parallel reactions or electrode passivation. These mediators may originate from the electrolyte or may be added externally to the system. They promote indirect electrolysis which is based on the electron transfer by these redox mediator dissolve in an electrolytic solvent and provide the necessary intermediate for the synthesis. Mediators may be organic or inorganic derivatives. Examples of inorganic compounds include transition metal complexes, multivalent metal ions, halide ions. Example of organic compounds include polycyclic aromatic compounds, triaryl amine, tempo, hypervalent compounds. In electrosynthesis, using transition metal complex mediator, complex transition metal act by transporting electron between the substrate and metal with the catalyst acting as an electron transfer region. Redox potential and the selectivity of the desired reaction can be controlled by ligand exchange of complex transition metal mediators. Pair electrolysis. In pair electrolysis, synthetically useful products are generated from both electrodes to optimize both the atom and energy economy of the reaction. The development of pair electrochemical reaction is important. Four different types of such pair electrolysis have been reported thus for, for parallel pair electrolysis, divergent electrolysis, convergent elect 
pair electrolysis and linear pair electrolysis all these types help in getting the benefit from both side of electrode and good oxidative and reductive products are achieved here is given a one example of parallel paired electrolysis in this parallel pair electrolysis the side products proton and methanol of the individual electrode reactions are necessary for the reaction at the counter electrode two valuable product can be obtained these are the basic information related to the organic electrolysis i hope this information will help to the beginner in the organic electrochemistry field